Hey everyone, good to see everyone out there. Uh, again, this is Dad from Zach and Dad, and today I'm going solo again, but we're not going to disappoint. We're going to try a great new product from Chipotle, which I think you're going to like as well. So let's get right into it. Of course, he's not Zach here today, but I'm Dad, and together we are Zach and Dad. Hey, it's good to see everyone. Um, yep, today, and, and I've kind of warned you before, I don't know if this light, I don't know, we'll see. We'll see how this light is. It's kind of getting, you know, it's getting fall, so it's kind of getting dark earlier, so I'm trying to get out here as quick as I can to, to hurry up and get here before it gets too dark. So excuse the lighting if it's not as good as usual, but I am alone today. Uh, welcome to, I guess, just Dad and Dad. Uh, this is the place for food reviews. Uh, food challenges, drive throughs and good old Chipotle kind of fun. If you do like what you see here, please like, subscribe, and click that bell for notifications so you never miss a beat. Yes, I am alone today. Um, again, uh, and, I, and I've kind of warned you um, that, you know, now Zach's getting older. He's a sophomore uh, with school and then studies, and then he's also in soccer uh, as well. And, you know, you know, he's just a, a teenager, high schooler, busy like that. We've made a decision. I talked to my son. We made a decision that we're not going to be able to do everything together. If you do watch Dad Shorts, uh, which is our shorts, you see I'm the only one doing it because Zach just doesn't have time to do it. And we've gotten to the place now that, and we're okay with it, that, you know, there's going to be times where we can't both be uh, together, but we're here together in spirit. And many of you uh, subscribers have told us that keep it going, keep it going. Even if Zach can't make it, just keep it going. I'd rather have... I'd rather have you guys keep going than just stopping it. And so that's what it is. So we're going to, I mean, it's going to be kind of more half and half, you know, a, a video with Zach, maybe a video with me, a video with back with Zach. So uh, just so you know, Zach's okay. He's great. There's nothing going on there. He's just busy right now. And when we can be together, we can. And when we can't, we can't. So anyway, today, um, it also worked out because I was out of town today uh, on business. And we don't have a Chipotle in town. So I was in a town that had a Chipotle. And when I'm in a town that has something else than's in our town that has something new, I'm going to hop on it. So anyway, Chipotle, which I love. Uh, if, if it was up to, well, let me know. Would you rather have Chipotle or would you like Cadoba? Which one do you like better, Chipotle or Cadoba? We do have a Cadoba in town. It's okay. I do like that I can get my guac included in it. Um, but I really love Chipotle better. It has better seasoning. Uh, it just, it fills me up more. It just tastes better. So when I can get to a Chipotle, it's great. Uh, what they have now is Chipotle has, uh, and it's only for a limited time. Uh, so get on it when you can. Uh, but they do have something called uh, the, they have a burrito. You can get this in a burrito or in a salad. I think you can get it in a taco too. I got it in a burrito form. But now you can get a smoked brisket burrito. And I love brisket. Oh, it's kind of the best part of the cow that I love is a good brisket. Um, if you never, I, I love it. So now you can get brisket on a burrito. So that's what we're trying today. Uh, it is $10.10. And if you know Chipotle, that's the thing too. They're a little, they're a little pricey, but the burritos are about the size of your head. So what this is, and I'll show it to you here, but let me explain it first a little bit. It has smoked beef uh, with Mexican spices. It also has fire roasted jalapenos. So I'm hopefully going to get a small little kick out of this. Um, it's going to also have chili peppers. So good. I, I kind of do like that kick. Um, it does say it has a unique chipotle brisket sauce. Uh, and then I got it. I got it. I like to get mine with the white rice on there. Uh, some black beans. Um, I got some of the mild salsa, uh, cheese, the grated cheese, and then lettuce on it. So my my burritos get pretty big, but you know I want to be full afterwards, especially after ten dollars. So they gave me plenty of uh, plenty of uh, napkins and all that. And uh, again, here's where Zach would normally be, and now all the food is on his seat. Anyway, so I have a little extra room. So all right, let's kind of get right down to it. I got it in a bowl. Um, I would suggest that if you ever get a burrito, especially to go from Chipotle, have them also put it in a container because you know when you eat a burrito, half of your burrito kind of mm, falls out of the burrito. 
Um, I've actually had the, I've actually had my burritos so big that when they try to roll it up, it breaks and busts all over. I love it because if it does, then they wrap it with another tortilla over it. So it's like double. So you get a little more there for your buck. Anyway, as you can see, again, these are the size. Oh boy, I hope the light works on this. Anyway, it's about the size of your head. I mean, literally look at this. It literally, it, well, from here, it's like bigger than my body. I mean, it's, that's how big it is joking of course all right let's see if i can do this thing i'm glad i'm not driving that's the one thing too about chipotle is your this really isn't food on the go you have to either be there or stop or somewhere so anyway here it is in all of its glory i'll show it i'm not going to open it up for you but i'll take a couple bites and then i'll show it all right chip it as my son would say chip it dip it mm. mm hmm mm hmm Mm. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that looks great. There's the cross section. You can see the beans in there. Or is that... Uh, no, I'm sorry. That's not the beans. Uh, that's meat. That's the brisket over there. But you see the um, layers. It, this wouldn't be a video unless I drop stuff. I'm sorry. Um, you, it, boy, you know, my wife... <laughs> When my wife uses the car, she's like, you did another video, didn't you? Yeah, it, it, it's a mess. And yeah, I know. Every time we do a video, we're dropping food all over the place. Um, but anyway, you see the combination of the rice. I love that white rice. I love that. Boy, I'm dropping more. I love that white rice on there. It has a great uh, cilantro uh, taste. You can see the salsa on there. But then a brisket. They And they do really put a lot of brisket in there. This is really really good. I really like it. Again, I really love Chipotle. What's good about this as well, and I'll kind of keep it on there so you can look at it, um, or maybe you want to, maybe I'll kind of go like this. No, I'm kidding. It's like a, oh, I should have done my senior picture like this. Eh, whatever. But anyway, the thing is, is that what I really like about it, it's like where uh, Mexican meets barbecue. It's almost like a Tex-Mex. When I really think of it, it's almost like a Tex-Mex because it has that, 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 that brisket gives it that, and the seasoning gives it like that great barbecue. Like if you would go to a barbecue place, um, you know, we have restaurants up here called Famous Dave's, um, but it has that like good old Texas barbecue or, you know, Kansas City barbecue, like brisket taste to it. But then you have the Mexican burrito taste. So it's almost like these two worlds, this Tex-Mex fusion happening here and it just blends together uh, with that brisket sauce uh, but with the traditional burrito so you have the traditional burrito but you have your Mexican or your traditional burrito but then you kind of have your Tex-Mex there so it's all coming together really good I really love it again I'm a huge brisket guy let me know if you're a brisket guy as well um, I really love brisket it's probably my best part of the cow um, I really love it. I love this. I recommend it. I will be going for this again. Uh, before we do a flavor rating, and I'm just going to let you know, I'm going to keep saying we because I'm so used to my son and I here. So if I say we, it's really me, but I'm going to just say we. Whatever, because our channel is still together. We're not going to separate the channels. We're still going to be together. We love you guys, and uh, we really, really appreciate that. Oh, hey, before I move on, some of you guys were wondering, how can we help you? Some of you guys actually have written, how can we help you get monetized? Because we see you're over a 1,000, but you're still not getting to the monetization. And that is because we are over a 1,000. We're actually over 1,100 now. Thank you so much for that. But our watch hours, uh, YouTube uh, wants 4,000 watch hours. And we're like at 2,700. So if you can really help us out, you know, maybe, and this is kind of what I'm thinking, but if you want to help us out, maybe binge watch, you know, you don't even have to watch them, just play, you know, just play all the videos, like in another room or something uh, on your laptop or computer, just have our videos playing. Uh, and that would, that would really help our watch hours out. Cause that's what we need now is once we get enough watch hours combined with the thousand plus subs, then we get, start getting monetized. Some of you have asked that, and I thank you very much for your support. I really do love that, and I really do appreciate that. And if you love our content, I'm, I'm glad you do. So anyway, before I give you a flavor rating, a uh, few things I'm going to ask you, uh, as I always do. Give me a thumbs up if you like Chipotle. I love it, and I hope you do too. Is this something you would try? Um, would you put it on your edible playlist that you would try it more than once? And what is your go-to item at Chipotle? They have a lot of do. They have a lot of great things at Chipotle. What do you love? What kind of burrito do you like? What kind of Doritos or Doritos? What kind of tacos do you like? What kind of bowls do you like? What at Chipotle brings you to Chipotle? And then, are you on team chips with salsa or chip chips with guacamole? 
I love guac. I'm always going to go guac. The only thing I don't like about Chipotle is guac is not included with Cadoba. Guac is included. So that's why I do love Ch uh, Cadoba because you can have all the guac you want for free. But Chipotle, you can't. But I do love it better. So let me know those things. I think that'd be great. All right. Let's do a flavor rating. Huh. Really is good. Again, I would recommend it. Um, and it's going to make you full. So it's a whole meal on its own. Um, all right. I think I know where I'm going to go with this. Um, all right. Here we go. Three, two. I don't even know why I'm cutting down. I don't even have my son with me. But it's part of our gig. So we'll do it. Three, two, one, eight. I'm going eight on this. It's a solid eight. I love it. Again, I'm not going to a 9 or 10. There's better things out there. I'm not going to go lower because this was really good. So I would really recommend it. Give it a try. If you tried it, let me know. If you haven't, please go out and then let us know as well. We really would appreciate that. If you're out there today and you're like, where is Zach? I wish Zach was there. I love you guys. That's great. Or if you just love our channel and you love food reviews, we do the food reviews so you can make a better choice on your budget. We would hate, you know what, because we don't want you to waste your money. So watch us. We'll waste the money for you so you can make a better choice on your budget. We all have limited funds and we want to spend them wisely. If you like what you see here, please like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, like us on the Facebooks. We do appreciate that. And again, as always, we know there's a thousand other places uh, on YouTube that you could go to see a father and son or just a father do food reviews. And there's a lot better ones out there. But I do really thank you for supporting us and loving us and helping us through and taking a small portion of your YouTube experience to watch Zach and Dad. We really do love that. We do appreciate that. And so we love you guys. Hopefully you're having a good week. I hope your week's going well. Let me know how life's treating you. I don't want this channel just to be food reviews. I want I want dialogue. I'll write you back. That's the thing. When you write me, I'm going to write you back. I love the, it's more than food reviews. It's a relationship. It's social media. It's connection. So write me, let me know how things are going in your life and I will let you know. I want to make it more social media connection here. So anyway, we thank you guys for being with us. We appreciate it. And as we always end, we'll see you. Oh, that's right. He's not here. Whoops. We'll see you on the flippity flop. God bless you guys. Take care and thanks for coming. Bye now.